because I forgot to mention this when this actually did happen, but RIP to Radical Softness. Um, I wasn't really familiar with her work. I think I saw her play, or I saw them play, I think in like E1 one time. I think so. I think so. I think Radical Softness playing E1. This is this might have been like 2019. Who's 2019? It might have been around then. I'm pretty sure. It was a long time ago. But unfortunately, Radical Softness died. Um, courtesy here of RA. So RIP to Radical Softness. Um, you know, friends and family. I can't, you know, imagine what you guys are going through now at the moment. It seems like the Berlin techno scene is having loss after loss after loss. I'm not too sure what the deal is there. Um, but yeah, I um, really do want to kind of extend my condolences out there to her family and friends. Um, let's read the actual article. It says DJ producer was a rising star in the Berlin's underground community radical softness real name leah rose besson has died at the age of 28 um zen z co-founder of paris label um Demino records announced the news via instagram post today on february 15th besson's passing was confirmed by their mother who commented on a post no cause of death is as known um from what i've been able to surmise again it's not my business i know it's a little bit kind of you know intrusive to do so um but from what i've been able to surmise it it's, it looks like it looks like it could have been um you know what you probably am imagining it could have been regardless of the circumstances and what caused it doesn't really matter it's just really sad to see somebody so young with so much potential um with so much promise ahead of them being kind of taken away from us um at this time and like i said before it just seems like the berlin scene or the scene in general is just having loads and loads and loads of issues like this so um i really do hope this people over there are kind of banding together and kind of supporting each other in these really hard times it continues here a resident of the berlin party raw matinee is that how you sell it raw mantique sorry and hamburg's tilt besson was a staunch um, advocate for self-expression the establishment of safer spaces and increasing the visibility of marginalized genders in the dance music co-founder of flinter party kylix um they first emerged on berlin circuit in 2019 and quickly gained recognition of their of their hard fast emotive sound that explored techno trance infused melodies following mixes for basayani's for basayani sorry podcast series and regular appearances on whore um, Besson played at Resident Advisor Party at Trezor late last year. Jesus, man. So, you know, so Radical Softness was definitely on the rise because, I, again, like I said, I, I'm pretty sure I remember seeing them play in E1. I think so. I forgot what, what the party was, but it was somewhere around that sort of time in 2019. A young artist was in the midst of the steadily growing career until their death, having played Munich's um, Rote Sonne Club in Rotterdam's Poing Club the previous two weekends. Last year, Besson travelled to Pakistan to play for the Groove into the Void Party in Karesh. Next month, they were meant to play alongside Dax J in Paris. Read some tributes to Besson in the Zinzi post below. And of course, you've got some articles here with the mix and whatnot. So RIP to Radical Softness, an absolutely tragedy to see this. Um, again, I'm not too sure what's going over there in Berlin. I'm not too sure what's going over here in London because we had some issues too. But it seems like things are coming to a head. I'm not too sure if it's like a consequence of like, you know, the lockdown and COVID and people coming out and just, you know, things are not going well. I'm not really too sure if it's just like in general, maybe a, a substance thing. I'm not too sure if it's just the world and where we are in terms of, as you know, humanity and whatnot but whatever it is um i think more than ever people need to kind of band around support each other hug each other and be there for each other and just try to hold each other close really in these trying time because it seems like we're all going through whatever we're going through silently and you don't need to do that you know what i mean if you want to reach out to people you can i'm pretty sure they'll be willing and able to connect with you in that regard because i feel like we all have our own um issues in our own way and um, we're all trying to manage as best as we can so rip to radical softness r.i.p to radical softness and my thoughts and feelings and prayers go out to their family friends and everybody else that kind of knew them r.i.p r.i.p